Welcome to my channel. I'm Zhang Jinxu. Let's look at the problem fifty-three in chapter nine. Chapter nine is about little momentum. In this one, you can see we have two box, right, or two object, m one and m two. The mass is given, and also initial velocity is given. And in several situations, we need to find the final velocity. The first one is two objects stick together. So in this one, we can see the we consider little momentum is conserved. Initial momentum equals to the final momentum. Finally, these two objects stick together, so they gain the same velocity. So in this one, initial velocity equals to final velocity, so we can get the answer easily. The second one is the two boxes. They just uh, do the elastic um, collisions, and we need to find for final velocity for v1 plus and v2 plus. There, for these collisions, we can see still. Momentum is conserved, right? Linear momentum is conserved. Initial momentum equals to the final momentum, and also because this is elastic, so that means the kinetic energy is conserved, right? So initial kinetic energy equal to final kinetic energy, and uh, yes, uh, it's a little bit difficult to solve these two equations, but we can remember the solutions from our textbook. These two agree, and you just write down these two equations, and then input is known quantities. Very easily, you can get the final answer for v one plus and v two plus. The next one is uh, it tell you the final after the collision, the velocity for the mass one is uh, zero stationary. Ask you to find v two plus. So it's easy because this is collision. The leader momentum is conserved. Initial momentum equals to the final momentum. Then we input a long quantity. It is a final result for v two plus. The next one is to get, tell you the v two plus is zero. Can you find v one? Yes, we still consider the leader momentum conserved, right? And the initial momentum equal to final, and input is known quantities. Get the final answer for v one plus. The next one is tell you v one plus is a negative four meter per second. Can you find v two plus? Sure, this one is still the application about leader momentum, and input is known quantities. Get the final answer. Now ask you, do you think your answer reasonable? Sure. So how can you think that? Because you can see this one moves forward, this one moves backward. After collision, this one moves backward. Do you think how about this one moves? Of course, from our daily life, this one will move forward. Agree. So two objects hit each other and then separate, and it moves in the opposite directions. And we can observe this from our daily life. Yeah, it's true. Thank you.